Do you take aspirin daily to prevent stroke? Millions do, but now recommendations from U.S. health officials could be shifting. For years, a daily aspirin dose has been recommended to prevent heart attack and stroke. But now that advice may be shifting. The benefits are smaller now to start aspirin to prevent the first heart attack or stroke. They are still there. Yesterday, the U.S. Preventative Services Task Force released a draft recommendation listing several proposed changes to its existing guidance. One, it's considering recommending adults 40 to 59 years of age and who are at a higher risk for cardiovascular disease but do not have a history of the disease to discuss taking aspirin with their doctor. It is the first time the task force has recommended adults in their 40s to do that. If somebody's actually started taking aspirin already or is on aspirin because they've had a heart attack or stroke, we definitely don't want them to stop. And in another proposed change, the task force draft recommends adults 60 and older should not start taking aspirin to prevent heart disease and stroke, pointing to new evidence showing the potential harms cancel out the benefits. Heart disease is the leading cause of death in the United States, causing about one in four. And while taking a daily low-dose aspirin has been shown to lower the risk of having a heart attack or stroke, the task force notes it also comes with serious risks for some. If somebody has a history of stomach ulcers or um, bleeding in the brain or is on blood thinners, um, other health conditions too, there definitely can be more risk. So the draft recommendation was posted for public comments, which is the typical kind of standard, which can be submitted from now through November 8th. So we'll certainly keep you posted.